Today we will talk about the lighter class, nuclear-powered guided missile cruisers, under consideration for the Russian Navy. The lighter class has the official name as Project 23560, or Leader. It is designed to replace the Sovereign class destroyers, the main anti-surface warships of the Russian Navy, as well as the Slava-class cruisers and the Utiloy-class anti-submarine destroyers. The project was approved in 2013, and in 2015, Severnoy Design Bureau was awarded a contract for the creation of a smaller, non-nuclear and heavier future destroyer. In 2016, the Krul of State Scientific Center handed the preliminary design of the destroyer to the Russian Navy. A May 2017 report indicated that the lighter-class destroyer had been dropped from Russia's state armament program due to financing reductions. However, in June 2017, United Shipbuilding Corporation announced the Russian Defense Ministry had approved the preliminary design of the lighter-class destroyer. In February 2019, a decision was made to build the 19,000-ton nuclear-powered variant of the cruiser, instead of the proposed 13,000-ton destroyer equipped with a gas turbine power plant. It is believed the construction of the lead vessel could begin as soon as 2023 followed by its induction in late 2030. Each vessel will cost around 100 billion Russian ruble. Again on April 18, 2020, the Russian newspaper Interfax reported that the Severnoy Design Bureau had suspended development on the lighter. However, in June, Alexei Rachmanov, head of the United Shipbuilding Corporation, reported that the project is still moving forward. Initially, 12 ships were planned to be built and split between Russia's northern and Pacific fleets. Later, the construction of eight vessels was mentioned. With a standard displacement of 19,000 tons, the cruisers will have a length of 230 meters, a beam of 20 meters, and a draft of 6.6 .6 meter. A flight deck and hangar will accommodate up to two medium-weight Ka-27 or Ka-32 helicopters. It will have extensive food storage and stores, giving them an independent cruising capability of 90 days. The lighter class will be fitted with advanced sensors and electronics countermeasure to protect against modern threats. Till now there is no information about the sensor and EW suite, which will be equipped on the lighter class cruiser. The lighter class is armed with 103S14 universal VLS cells capable of launching the Onyx, Caliber, and Zircon anti-ship cruise missiles. A navalized version of the S-500 will provide ballistic missile defense and air defense against airborne threats at ultra-long ranges with 56 missiles. Besides, the Redet air defense system will provide air defense at medium and long ranges. Shorter and close-in air defense will be provided by the Panzer M and Palash weapon systems. For anti-submarine warfare, the lighter class will be equipped with rocket launchers and 12 533mm torpedo tubes, capable of firing both torpedo and ASW missiles. The ship will also have an A192M Armat 130mm naval gun. The ship is powered by a combined nuclear and steam propulsion system. The propulsion system provided 32 knots or 59 km per hour maximum speed. Currently Russian Navy operates two Kirov-class battlecruisers, three Slava-class cruisers, eight Utiloy-class destroyers, and two Sovremeni-class destroyers. Some reports suggest that the Russian Navy had a plan to acquire 20 lighter-class cruisers to replace its all battlecruisers, cruisers, and destroyers. Lighter-class destroyer is still on the drawing boards, looks like a dangerous ship with hypersonic missiles and the most advanced S-500 missile defense system, but it may lag in electronics warfare capability. Still, it will be too early to conclude any conclusions.